<clears throat> what is up, guys? Watch this. <laughs> <laughs> what time is it? About 8.15 in the morning? Yeah, 8 o'clock. You got cracked over a doosie. That'll be the last time. Why did I like charge to 86%? Oh, yeah. Fruit gusher shots. Let's go. Yeah. Oh, That's so hard way to start the morning. What's up, guys? Firebird Fest, Friday morning. Oh, yeah. Let's start the morning. What's up, guys? Firebird Fest, Friday morning. Day two. It's 8 o'clock. Well, after 8. Uh, oh, gosh, Oreos. Oh, 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 you can dump some Oreos. No. We're gonna be going, we gotta find breakfast and pack a cooler. Um, there's a thing right down the street, that's the opening thing. It's a car, classic car dealership or something. I, I don't know if, well yeah, I know that, but I don't know if we're just gonna chill there for a bunch of time. I think that's what it is, so it doesn't matter what time we get there really. So yeah. Yeah, well, it said, I know it said 8. It started like 8 for the Firebird thing. but So, yeah, so we're going to pack a cooler, find some breakfast, and go over there, hang out. See you then.
What is up, guys? We are here in line waiting for the ferry jump. The Grafton Ferry River jump. We've been sitting here for like half hour. Got some other cars in front of us. Got some cars behind us. Cross a ferry, then we gotta find somewhere to eat or do something after that until the movies or I don't know what we're doing. We'll figure it out. Keep you updated. What's up, bro? And we're moving. We're on the ferry across the Mississippi. Cool stuff. What's up guys? We're at the drive-in movie theater. Wait, hold on. Uh, here, hold my bear. That's not a beer. Shut up. <laughs> it's about doing a root beer bottle. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, it's really slow. It's root beer. It's root beer, guys. Sorry. <laughs> Be watching Smokey and the Bandit pretty soon. Salty popcorn. Yeah, popcorn's pretty salty. Ain't bad, though. It's like. Got the jams plan. My lights probably gonna kill the battery, but there should be someone to help jump my Rip car. The Milwaukee battery to jump it. Downloaded a radio app on my phone. We're gonna because my radio, the antenna disconnected from the radio. But this little Bluetooth scanner thing that works with the radio that works. So right now I can run Bluetooth. So if I can use this to get the signal, the broadcast, it'll then run to that, and it will then run to my radio. Solid plan. It's probably not gonna work, but we're gonna try it anyways. So um, after this, <clears throat> we're gonna go back to the hotel room, take showers. I'm then going out for food. All right. Well, this guy here wants to go to bed. He's been kind of just being a little cranky. I'm how far you salty. <laughs> when Nick gets hungry, woo! Right, Nick? got that right. Yeah. So. Those popcorn are gonna hit the spot. Jeez, man. Well, maybe you should try. Here, here, just take a second. I don't want your Mountain Dew in a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. It's getting darker, but hopefully the movie should come on pretty soon. Yeah. Gonna have a good time. What's up, guys? End of Friday. Firebird Fest. Um, movie was great. We fixed my radio in the parking lot. Uh, we tore the whole thing out of my car and plugged the antenna wire back in. Got that working. Um, lost a screw. You know how that goes. We're back. Uh, you good in there? No. <laughs> we're back at the hotel now. It's 11 o'clock. We were thinking about going somewhere for food. But tomorrow we gotta get up early because they leave at seven to go to the racetrack that's right we're going to a racetrack um do some laps not fast laps unfortunately but it is what it is um i saw i had some fruit gushers oreos and some chips for my dinner probably crack open a, crack open a dooski say hi nick bathroom's got good water pressure it does have good water pressure it's nice um yeah and i'm gonna take a shower and go to bed because we gotta get up early which we probably won't get up early but we're gonna try we won't get up early. i, get I up won't get up early. i hate getting up early i hate it i hate it i hate it so yeah anything to say bedtime la cool cars la cool cars bro okay see you guys tomorrow bye good morning guys we're out here it's a rainy Saturday morning. We made it to the racetrack, but unfortunately, 
Um, it's raining, so they delayed the start of it. <clears throat> so we kind of hung out in the hotel room. I fell asleep again. And then they made the announcement that they were going. And I woke up like an hour after the announcement made was made. So we got here late. Uh, I just talked to a guy. They already made some laps, but the racetrack's kicking them out because of the rain. It was supposed to go to like 11 or 12. I mean, it's it's 9 and 9.30. So kind of sucks I wasn't able to do that. But I mean, it is what it is. So I think, I think we're going to find something to do. Anything we could do? We're gonna go find something to do. So, something like that, yeah. All right. Catch you guys later. Hey guys, so we're in the middle of a rainstorm. It is raining so bad right now. We got a river in here. We're sitting in a bank. Um, we had to pull off the freeway because my windshield wiper broke. We fixed it. But we're just gonna sit here and hang out because there's no point when you can't really see where you're going. So, there's no rain really blowing in here. The top leaks, so there's no point getting that all wet more. But we're kind of in a puddle as you can see too, but. We first stopped over at that gas station and uh, it was blowing in. And so, uh, what's up guys? Go check out the video. Um, so Nick saw this, so we pulled up in here and we fixed the windshield wiper, but, uh, we, it was a fourth gen Firebird. It was me and then a, actually it looked like a first gen. It was a first gen Firebird that was behind me. Um, they kept going, but I had to pull off the road. So. I don't know. We were headed to Waterloo, Illinois to the car show. I mean, that technically didn't start till one, but we were just gonna go get some food and hang out in there. But um, yeah, so this is where we're at. We got some fruit gushers, some Oreos, Mountain Dew and some water. So we'll just hang out here, wait it out. And uh, once it chills out, then we'll uh, continue back on our way. So I'll let you guys know what's happening from there. Peace. We're in the Rural King in Waterloo, Illinois. Car show got canceled because of rain. So now we're just kind of bumming around. For seven hours. For seven hours till the concert starts. <laughs> oh, maybe I should get some new work boots. Because it has shocks on it. I like the other ones. Like This is actually very nice. Yeah. Try it out. There's tools on the ground. Buy this to a burnout bike. Burnout bike. Okay. It passes the inspection. Oh, it's a little thunder, yeah. Yeah, pretty dry. Car show's back on. We're all meeting up in Waterloo, Illinois' uh, Walmart parking lot. And then at 1.30, we're all gonna drive into Waterloo's Main Street and park there and uh, chill out. So yeah, should be a good time. Some more Trans Am showing up right now. So, should be a good day. decided that I wasn't going to take it on this trip with the supercharger, so I put it all back together with my nitrous intake and my big skull converter, and we re retuned the car to uh, make it more of a road trip car, and uh, that's when we came on this trip. But when I get back, I'm going to tear it apart again and start on the supercharger. If it gets here. <laughs> What's the red end? Uh, this is just a part of the fuel system. That's a fuel filter. And then that's a catch can, oil catch can. 
this motor's got a big ring gap in it to run a lot of nitrous, so it creates a lot of blow by and it creates a lot of crankcase pressure. 4.8 liter turbocharged. I thought they were eights. Oh, my, my bad. 4.9 liter turbocharged. Sounds like we got, uh, <laughs> sounds like we got ourselves a bandit. Some guy out, he's like, I got a pro charger for that thing. That one guy at the gas station. Yeah. You don't see that a whole lot. Oh, it's a manual. It's a bandit's driving stick. All right, guys, so my spoiler just gave loose. He's a wee bit fucked. And I can't drive it like this. So, yeah, because that comes out. Yeah. So, we're going to have to do some uh, work. Fabrication. Zip tie. We're going to zip tie it on. We got to pop that rivet out first, though. So. Oh, wait. Why didn't I put a rivet on there? That one? Yeah, I'm an idiot. All right, well, time to fix it. We pop the rivet out. We put a zip tie in it temporarily. It's really loose. We're gonna try going to a part auto parts store or something to try to get some rivets. Pop new rivets in it. 
So yeah, let's uh, see what happens. We're here at Rural King. We're gonna buy a rivet gun, some rivets. Let's see if we can fix it. Get hit by a car too. And get hit by a car, cause that'll be fun. So uh, hopefully we can fix it. We'll, uh, no, this works. We'll see what we can find. Oh, wait, wait, oh, 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 oh. Yeah, there we go. Trans Am, LS swap Trans Am. There's some more room there. All right, guys, we got the new rivet in and there's originally a spot for two rivets, but for some reason GM only GM used and one. GM infinite wisdom decided to use only one. Only one, like the hole wasn't even drilled for the second one in the They're spoiler. They're on a little plate, but not in the spoiler. Yeah, side. so we drilled the second hole. We end up doing that to say the other side too. So there's two rivets now, two rivets now. The problem with these I've had with the spoiler is there's there's like a screw with a plastic end that's glued to the bounder side of the spoiler. It's starting to rain, so I'm gonna make it quick. And the problem is the glue gave loose. And I tried to re-glue in it, but basically this side still holds. And like that side there. But um otherwise. The glue's broken, so that's why it's loose. We re-riveted it. Hopefully it'll hold. We have the rivets. We have a rivet gun now, and I'm almost gonna sit on my knife. That one. That one be good. Get in here before I keep draining. The what was What is that? My keys are still in the lock. <laughs> I wonder how long it would have taken me for uh, to notice where my keys went. All right, we didn't scratch it. We're good. All right. I don't care if it got scratched. So it's fixed. Hopefully it holds up. Worst case, we take the spoiler off and stick it in the back here. Yeah. So, yeah. So. All right, on our way to the hotel. I bought a new PS4 game. I'm going to throw that, download that on while the ZZ Top concert we're going to tonight's playing. So, yeah. We'll see what all happens. See ya. Oh, good evening, guys. That was a wrap. Saturday night. I forgot to bring the GoPro to the concert. It was a ZZ Top tribute band. They were pretty good. We then went out, got some food, went cruising a little bit. It's about 1230. And uh, we're going to call it a night. Um... There's a thing tomorrow at a farm or something like that. We're not we're not going to it. We're going to probably sleep in a little bit and then pack a couple things I want to check on the car and then we're going to we're going to highball back to Wisconsin. Um I got some stuff that I want to get done tomorrow, so and pretty tired, pooped out. I already sent enough on gas. I mean this farm we're going to is like 30 minutes away in the wrong direction it's like nah i'm good i am good so yeah <sighs> guess i'll see you guys in the morning good morning guys <laughs> how's it going it's sunday morning last day we didn't go to any of the firebird fest functions we're like the last car, there's like two or three more cars in the parking lot. They're all at some farm right now, but we're, we decided to sleep in and we're gonna go back to Wisconsin right now. Pretty much packed up, got the cooler full of ice and soda. Everything's about cleaned up. We just need to stop at Walmart to return the PS4 game I got because it's not what I wanted. And it, yeah, and then we can top off the tank. I wanted to check some electrical stuff on it first, but then top off the tank and, oh yeah, get some food and then go back to Wisconsin. So let's go. What's up guys? I am back in Wisconsin, dropped Nick off. I'm on my way back to my house right now, about five minutes from my house. 